Hey everyone and welcome to Best Mind. Today we're going to learn about top tips to instantly be more charismatic. Now let's begin. People treat charisma like this intangible quality that some people have and some people don't. It feels like certain individuals are just naturally more charismatic than others. Somehow they can express themselves in a way that wins people over. They can motivate, rejuvenate, and comfort others without even trying, but is charisma really innate and intangible? The truth is, charisma is a social skill that anyone can learn. A 2012 study tested this by measuring whether or not charisma training can improve social perception. Now, at the beginning of the study, researchers told a group of mid-level managers to give a speech when they finished the audience rated how well each speaker did. Unsurprisingly, most of them didn't do so well. Over the next few months, these managers were trained to be more charismatic, they learned how to adjust their voice, their language, and their gestures to become more appealing communicators. Once they completed their training, the managers gave the same speech a second time. Sure enough, their audience awarded them significantly higher ratings. Their training had increased their likability, improved their public speaking, and made them into more effective leaders. In a professional environment, these three characteristics are invaluable. So how did they do it? How exactly does training make someone more charismatic scientists have identified over a dozen strategies which they call charismatic leadership tactics, or CLTS. These tips are designed to transform the way that other people perceive you in their eyes, you'll appear more persuasive, more comfortable, and more confident. Your co-workers will see you as a natural leader who's both influential and trustworthy. Now, of course, CLTS aren't reserved for the workplace. A 2018 study found that the majority of people understand charisma the same way in and outside of professional settings. Unlike most social traits, people have a pretty clear idea of what charisma looks like. Generally, it has two dimensions, influence and affability. In other words, a charismatic person will effectively guide other people while making them feel calm and secure. So what can we learn from this discovery? Well, it tells us that training focused on charisma and leadership won't just make you a better manager. It can dramatically improve your relationships, self-esteem, and social skills, giving you a boost in every aspect of your life. But here's the best part about CLTS they can increase your charisma right off the bat. Now, many of these tips do take some time to master, but you'll immediately notice a difference in the way people interact with you. Whether you want to become a well-respected leader, or just a more confident friend. Use these 5 tips to increase your charisma right away. Number 1. Connecting Language If charisma has never been your strong suit, you might have trouble engaging other people when you're talking. When giving speeches, do you find your audience looks bored or disinterested? Even during casual conversations, a lack of verbal charisma can leave people feeling confused and uncomfortable. So what techniques can you use to engage others in a way that's clear, powerful and appealing? Well, you can start by changing how you express ideas. Just imagine you're trying to explain your job as someone with no experience in your field. You ramble on for 15 minutes about the technicalities of your work, only to discover that they aren't listening. They don't really care. So why couldn't you hold their interest? Well, chances are you made a very common mistake that people make on a daily basis. When that person asked you about your job, what went through your head? you are probably thinking about the most accurate way to explain what you do. But charismatic language isn't about being 100% correct or explaining every tiny detail. It's about finding ways for other people to personally relate to the things that you say. Oftentimes, that means simplifying or rewarding your message so that anyone can understand exactly what you mean. Comparisons are one of the most effective ways to get your point across instead of rambling about your job. Use a metaphor or simile to give them the gist of what you do. Okay, let's say for example, you describe yourself as your company's garbage disposal. 
That comparison might mean a lot more to someone than telling them your actual job title. So if you want to engage your listeners, change your approach to self-expression. Remember that your goal is to connect with people and not bore and confuse them. Number two, promote engagement. You can also encourage engagement by involving other people in your speech. Great public speakers use this technique all the time. Even though they're standing on a stage talking to an audience. Charismatic speakers make you feel like you're part of the program, you're much more likely to stay focused and invested. Because you're given an active role to play. Like metaphors and similes. These opportunities for involvement allow you to connect with your audience. So each time you give them the chance to weigh in, it feels like you're considering their opinions and perspectives. People are much more likely to listen when they feel like they're being heard. But what does an opportunity for involvement actually look like? Okay, let's say you're giving a presentation in class. Normally, your classmates stop paying attention the moment you start talking but there's an easy way to engage everyone in the room at the same time. Just ask them a question that leads into something that you're about to talk about. Let people raise their hands and solve the problem on their own. Then once you've given them a chance to think about it, reveal the answer. This simple change will make whatever you say much more interesting and memorable because you got your audience involved. And even if they don't care, people will listen for the answer just to know whether they were right or wrong. If you can't physically engage people, rhetorical questions are useful replacement. You can actually use them a couple of different ways. You can ask challenging questions to encourage people to think about their answers. Or you might use obvious questions to make a more impactful argument. The fact that one answer is so apparent to everyone in the room just proves your point. Now, we've been using examples related to public speaking, but this tip works just as well. One-on-one, -on -one, people will find you more charismatic if you make an effort to include them in whatever you're saying. You're showing that you care, which makes them more comfortable and you more trustworthy. Number 3. Express your creativity. Would you describe hyper-charismatic people as creative? Well, it's probably not the first word that comes to mind. But charisma and creativity go together more often than you think. We admire people who can express themselves in unique and powerful ways. Just think about your favorite writers, artists, and musicians. You love their work because of how it makes you feel. You can relate to the emotions they've captured in their stories, paintings, and songs. In one way or another, their work affects you on a deeper level, making it both memorable and influential. But that's not the only reason we find creative individuals so charismatic. Many people spend their lives trying to set themselves apart from the crowd. They want to show the world that they have something unique to offer. Well-known creative people have done exactly that. They've expressed their personal vision and received recognition for it. They discovered a way to stand out making them pioneers of something new and exciting. You'll find that people admire creative ideas and out-of-the-box thinking, but only when you're confident in yourself. And if you are people will envy your fearlessness and individuality. While your goal should never be to make people jealous, they will perceive you as more charismatic because you were unafraid to express your vision. Number 4. Revealing Integrity Trust is a huge part of charisma before people will listen to a word you say they have to believe that you're telling them the truth, they need to know that you have their best interest in mind. So where does trust come from? Well, when deciding whether or not to trust someone, you pull information from all over the place, everything from the way someone dresses to the amount of eye contact they make changes your perception of their character. This is especially important when giving speeches or having short conversations. You don't have enough time to make promises or keep secrets. So people rely on shortcuts to establish your credibility. That's why the CLT is to show the quality of your character. You need to prove to your audience that you're worth listening to. 
you might try empathizing with their struggles, or you might tell a story to demonstrate the kind of person you really are. If you give people a reason to believe in you, there's a good chance they will. Number 5 Lofty Goals Throughout History Influential leaders like Gandhi and Martin Luther King Jr. have earned respect by setting lofty goals for themselves and their followers. When they began their movements, they weren't satisfied with just changing a few minds. These leaders wanted to change the entire world for the better, and they genuinely believed they could make it happen. Their followers knew that their leader was confident they would achieve any goal no matter how impossible it sounded. This kind of confidence is one of the charismatic qualities in a person. It's what makes people consider you an inspiring figure. Your conviction will motivate others to follow in your footsteps or chase their own definition of success. Ah, but you don't have to be a leader to put this CLT into practice. By strongly believing in both yourself and the people around you, you'll win their support and their respect. Hey, thank you for watching Best Mind. If you have enjoyed this video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this.